Hello and welcome to my channel. If you are new, my name is Shireyelle. Hi. <laughs> Today, first of all, excuse the, the sound. It might sound like a shower is running. That's because my neighbor, I don't know if it's my neighbor, downstairs neighbor, whatever, but somebody is taking a shower and every time I feel like I want to record in the bathroom, somebody's taking a shower. But whatever, we're not going to be here for that long. Oh, this video is going to be a self, wait, which way should I do it? Self maintenance video. Or this way, self-maintenance. I don't know which way the text is gonna come up. <laughs> self-maintenance video. Baby, I've been on a budget and I'm just a self-maintenance uh, self person anyways. Like I don't really like to pay people to do things that I know I can do because I'm very particular with certain things like my eyebrows. I don't let nobody touch. The last time somebody touched my eyebrows, they were like this thin. I was pissed, pissed. <laughs> I used to get my nails done but then when I moved I couldn't find somebody to do it and then when I also went to the nail salon prices were like stupid high out here I live in LA I was like I'm not doing this when I can do it myself I know how to do acrylic nails I used to do them all the time on myself but now I just do press-ons because I don't have time for the acrylics I hate the smell um it just it really ruins my nails you know press-ons they kind of do because the way I take them off <laughs> I just be popping these babies off but if you soak them off it's fine it's fine for your nails um and oh my God, I heard somebody. <laughs> and um I can do them very well I found nails that hold very well um and glue that holds very well so I just use them I don't like painting my nails they're already painted it's cool the only thing I really paint is my toenails and I do my toenails myself as well because they can never do the shape that I want to do. They, they just piss me like the nail salon pisses me off every time I go. <laughs> so um, we're going to attempt to do all of this tonight. If I don't finish this all of this tonight, I will do it another day and I will just obviously put it in this video. But I feel like I'm going to finish it all tonight. Like I, it's, it's only what 746. I don't have nothing else to do tonight. So. I'm a little bit tired I just woke up from a nap though like an hour but I just want to be a bum today like I don't I just don't want to do anything I don't want to be social I don't want to I don't even want to do, talk on camera like I don't want to do anything but I'm gonna do it because um you guys like the last video that I did so I'm gonna do this one we're gonna wash my hair today I've been wanting it curly and because it's been coming out cute curly even though it is a little bit damaged because I've been straightening the hell out of my hair for straight hair season you know or silk press season baby we only get like three or three months two three months to really flex with our straight hair <laughs> curly girls no we only get that many or months you know that little short season to really flex and um especially gym girls we can't we can't really do as much you know because we regret going not going to the gym when our hair is straight and then when we do go to the gym the hair gets messed up especially if you sweat in your roots like I do your hair is not lasting that long like I've tried it's still you know it's a little bit curly in the inside even if you like press it all down and do the hacks that they say and blah 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 I tried it it's not bad it lasts a little bit but I I just am like you know what I want this to last as long as I can um so yeah I, I overdid it a little bit this this month overdid it a little bit um, but it's okay. I mean, not this month, this season, this silk press season. I overdid a little bit, but it's okay. I like the way my curls have been coming out. It's a little bit of um, damage, you know, still straight parts, but my hair does take a little bit long to come back to normal. But I've been liking the curls and I've been doing the co coil method and blah, 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 blah. So whatever. I'm going to show you how I do all that anyways. But what's been really helping my hair is the Olaplex number three. And this is like a bond treatment that repairs and straightens your hair or straight strengthens strengthens your hair not straightens strengthens <laughs> strengthens your hair and um then I go in with the shampoo and usually the conditioner with it too but I ran out so I'm just going to use the Taraji conditioner but I'm doing this you do this before you wash your hair so I'm going to take a shower right now and I'm going to put this in before I wash my hair and I'm going to wash my hair in the sink. I've been doing that because I've been trying to stop washing it in the um, the shower because I shower with really hot water and shower water is not really great. Even though I do have a filter, I need to get a change anyways. But um, I, I don't like showering in cold water. I don't care. I don't want to keep turning it down. Da, 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 da. So I've been going back to my childhood days when my mom used to put my head in the sink and <laughs> just wash my hair. You know, I am tall. It's a little, it's a little bit of bending, 
but it's okay I, I just rather do it over there it's easier for me than doing in the shower I like I just and then you get the, all the hair on you that I'm just not liking it lately so I just been doing it in the kitchen so I'm gonna try to film as much as I can but anyways let me stop talking and let me take a shower Okay, so I'm starting off by washing my hair with this Olaplex number four, Olaplex, <laughs> Olaplex number four shampoo. Um, I had the bond on for about 45 minutes, um, the number three bond for about 45 minutes, but it does say you should leave it on for at least 10 minutes um, and go as long as, like, as long as you desire. So I just go about 45 to an hour sometimes, depending on if I forget, I don't know. Sometimes I just leave it on. <laughs> but I don't feel like you should go too much with it, like too long with it. But I feel like 45 to an hour is just, it's been making my hair feel nice. So I'm cool with it. Anyways, um, yeah, so I'm in my handy DNJ <laughs> sink. Um, I really need, I seriously need to get one of those, um, like the curve sink faucets because this is just, it's, it's terrible. But it's okay, you know, we're gonna make it work. But anyways, um, I'm going in with this Taraji, um, I don't know the exact name, but I'm gonna list it down below. I got it sent in a PR. It's, I think it's only her only um, hairline, but it's like a mint conditioner thing. Ugh, terrible user right now. I don't have, <laughs> I don't have the list near me. But um, yeah, so it's, it's actually very soothing on my scalp. Um, I haven't used any other like and any of the shampoo or anything else that was sent to me which i should do in another video but i've been liking the um conditioner it's nice and smooth it smells great and um it feels really good on my scalp but this is what my little curls look like you know they're not bad there's a little bit of a looser texture so i would say it's more so on the 3c side than 3c 4a like that's what i'm usually i have a little bit tighter curls but right now it's, it's more on the 3c side there's some there's a little bit of damage but we're working on it we're working on it so this i've used this day soft Fro. i've used this spray since i was a little kid but they don't sell it no more it's very random that you're gonna find it but i feel like the the guy at the beauty supply store said they like discontinued it or something whatever um so yeah i just used the the cream of it this is pretty much the same thing and then I go on with the Camille Rose moisture milk this is my beauty my baby I love it I love it so 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 much <laughs> I love it so much um I haven't really been putting on putting too much product in like too like a variety of products I've just been sticking to oh my god I really can't talk I just been sticking to um to the, the main two the stay soft bro just to moisturize my scalp and moisturize my hair a little bit a little bit more and then um putting the camille rose moisture milk and i just been loving how it's been coming out sometimes i'll use the honey hydrate um but it's not really my favorite that i go to but if i have it on me and i don't have any more of like one of the products or something like that then i'll just use that so i just been finger curling my hair it's been saving my curls it's been actually looking decent <laughs> nice to wear with the finger curls i don't curl them really tight but i just make sure it's a nice ringlet and then i oh my god i'm behind um let me speed up oh <laughs> and then i just diffuse my hair and next we are in the um <laughs> we're in the eyebrow process so yeah eyebrows are pretty much self-explanatory just take your time because you can literally tweeze your eyebrow off and shave your eyebrow off trust me i've done it before but i've been doing my eyebrows since i was i believe like early 20s by myself um and yeah so i just know my routine i take my time i go really slow i make sure that i prep my stuff with alcohol like i clean all my tools with alcohol at first and I clean my skin with alcohol, make sure it's nice and clean. And I just shave it and also tweeze it. You know, I was never really a wax girl. I think I've gotten my my eyebrows waxed a few times and I just, uh, you know, it's just not great for me. I don't know what it is. And like sometimes I break out and everything and it's just not a great a great thing for my skin. But I do shave my little mustache. Shout out to the girls, I got a little, little, little peach fuzz. <laughs> it doesn't get crazy dark, but I just don't like it on me at all. And my makeup lays way better when it is shaved off and you know, just my skin looks a little bit brighter. When my, um, some parts of my faces are shaved, I don't shave my whole entire face. 
I just shave, you know, the sides where my little, uh, my little, what is it called? What is it? What is the, what is the, what is the side piece called? What is this? What is the side? Not the side piece, but <laughs> what are the side pieces called? Oh my God, it's going to bother me. Um, yeah. So I just make sure those parts are shaved. You know what I'm talking about and make sure my mustache is shaved and that's pretty much it. So now I'm just going to take a cotton pad and get alcohol again and just make sure everything is nice and rubbed off. And then this is when I would do my skincare, but I just didn't do it on camera because I've done it in so many other videos. So next are my nails. This is definitely the next day because I was tired, ready to go to bed. Um, I don't know if you've seen my dark circles, but they were there. <laughs> um, so yeah, I just do my own press-ons. I, you know, uh, use the machine to, uh, what is it called? File my nails. Yep. And then I just use these little, I usually have cuticle cutters, but I have no clue where they are. So I just use these little scissors, but I cut off my cuticles, not all the way, but you know, just cut off the little skin, the excess. And then I file the little nail down. These, all this nail stuff will be down below because I do have certain ones that I get, certain nails that are stronger than like the kiss nails and stuff like that. And then this nail girl is chef's kiss, chef's kiss. So any mistake that I make when I do glue it on, I always use alcohol and just wipe it off and it comes off right away. Or you just put some oil on when you're done and it all comes off. But yeah, clip them, clip them, then file them. Just do as, I don't do much because they are already coffin and I like coffin nails, it's my favorite. So I just clip them down a little tiny bit and then file them down to the shape that I like. Like I like a certain type of straight coffin shape. You know, I have to file down, just file down. <laughs> and then, um, yeah, that's it. That's it for my nails. And I just put cuticle oil on when I'm done. And well, I wash my hands first for sure. I get all the dust off and then put cuticle oil on this. I got from Amazon. I'll list out that down below as well. But um, I definitely need to start using more cuticle oil um, on my nails, like on a daily basis, because it definitely makes your nails grow. And I just very, very lazy when it comes to certain things like that. But this color was so pretty on my nails. I loved it. I loved it. Okay, so this is how my hair came out. Boom. It's actually the next day. I don't know if I mentioned it or not, but well, it's the next night. But I finally got to actually like take my hair out and do something with it. So that's what it looks like. See, I've been liking the curls. It's been looking cute. It's a little skimpy. A little bit, but what, what can you do? You just gotta wait for it to revert back. Um, I honestly might cut this little piece. Um, I don't know what it's gonna look like straight, but I feel like this piece is just kind of driving me crazy because it's so full up here and it's never really, it's never been full down here. So I think I'm just gonna chop those pieces and just make my hair like really full. I don't know, something like that. But anyways, um, I'm a little late. I am about to go to this little party and then I'm glad I got work tonight. So I just have all black on and then I'm gonna wear these uh, boots, these leather boot heels, well, pleather, whatever. Um, Yeah, so that's it. Hope you guys enjoyed my little um thing. This is what my eyebrows look like filled in, you know? They always look good filled in because I know how to finesse it. I know how to finesse it, but I just been kneading in it needing it <laughs> i just been needing it done for real and actually doing it and my eyebrows came out really nice i should have showed what my eyebrows look like this morning but anyways i gotta go i'm rushing a little bit what is new <laughs> um if you haven't already subscribe subscribe like also comment what you think below and that's it bye bye